started with uh, Lewis Bond, who scored his fifth touchdown today. Precious yeah, one. I did your day as well. Thanks, Dave. Precious one, yep. Yeah, appreciate you. What did you see when you saw that open field on that wide receiver screen? What were you, what were you thinking? What were you All doing? credit to Joe. He took two people out on that play. Like, okay. He's been. Joe is somebody that is extremely talented. I got I got to get on him every day about staying up on himself, knowing that what he can do can really help the team. So I really credit that touchdown to more to Joe than me. So when you see Ryan go down, how hard is it to mentally stay in the game? But also, you know, does that kind of fuel you guys to take it over the finish line? I prefer not to answer that question. I'm sorry. Lewis, when you're when you have those plays where you can break out and, and you know either bowl through a defensive back or, or get away from a defensive back after the ball, what are some of the things that you're looking for on that? I know you had the you know Joe on that on that touchdown, but the one that set up uh, Pat Garlow's touchdown as well. I'm just thinking, like I said uh, in my last uh, media thing, I said I don't think anybody in college football could tackle me one on one. So I just take a great sense of pride, and when I get the ball, I'm grateful for. Being on the having the opportunity to get the ball, so I just try to make the most of all my opportunities, knowing what my skill set is, knowing that I have a strong lower half. So it's like I feel like I have to break those tackles in order to stay on the field because that's what I bring to the team. Offense has started slow the past two games. How do you guys look to address that, and why is that? We, I feel like we could be such a great offense, but we just shoot ourselves in the foot so much. It's something that we just got to keep going like keep working through because as you see when we're, we're on we're on it's just we can't take that long to get on defense played well to start but we weren't on then they continue to play well and we've, we got it together we just got to work on getting hot as soon as we our first drive running game game opened up in the second half how does that make your job easier um I feel like we have a lot to do with the run game uh we take five yard run receivers as I'm saying receivers take five yard runs and make them 20 15 so I just I think everybody, every receiver that's on this team takes great pride in blocking. Like you've seen Joe spark a whatever, how long that touchdown was. We just take great pride in blocking. And we know if we block, DBs get a little, little hesitant when you're physical with them in the run game. Thomas, a bit of a shaky start by his time. <coughs> he bounced back. Is it nice having a quarterback who just stays poised in those situations and never really gets rattled at all? Yeah, that, that's a big thing. Uh, we, we started slow, like, like he said. Um, but he never. He never put his head down, never dwelled. And that's, that's something that's like a, a real good quality to have. So. What changed in the second half? We just got high. I'm, I'm telling you, we're, we're a good offense. We're a good team. We just can't start slow. We can't get in our own way. We can't have false starts. I had a penalty today, so it's, it's everybody on the team. We got we to gotta be better not shooting ourselves in the foot. Uh, Tommy said this in one of his media. We, we haven't been stopped by anybody. We stopped ourselves and make it harder for ourselves. Lewis, what do you think of the atmosphere today? Family weekend, crowd was jacked up. Just what do you think? Uh, it was it was a decent crowd today. I wish it was more people. We just got to keep winning. Wins bring fans, so we just got to keep doing our part. All right, everybody. Thanks, Lewis. Thanks, Lewis.